Good evening, everybody, and welcome to our tax day uh, version of the select board meeting. Uh, we actually would be starting the tri board meeting right now, but because we have the election, we need to take care of some select board business first. So um, we need to do some reorganization in the select board. Is there any discussion about how we want to do this? I'm going to make a motion that uh, we appoint Gilford um, Mooring as our chairman. Second. You should at least think about it a little bit. <laughs> okay, consider it done. I'm not a newbie here. You know. <laughs> <laughs> a little time out for uh, consideration. All those in favor? Aye. 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 All right, thank you. I hope I'm doing a good job. So. You run a fine meeting. Yes, you do. <laughs> thank you. Okay, so with that being said, <clears throat> that's all set. Um, I would like to talk about the, the assigning liaisons. Mm -hmm. And I thought it over, and you know, we talked about this a little bit last year about maybe holding a little retreat to talk this out a little bit and just having this one item on the agenda. And I'm kind of leaning towards that is really we ought to just have, a, even though it has to be in public, hold a retreat and then for us to talk and, and talk more about the liaisons and how we want to set them up. And maybe we can invite the people we're working with as liaisons to come to this retreat too and just have one meeting that we talk about this and lay it all out. So, I mean, do you know what? I'm kind of limited, but I've been around to all the town offices a number of times already. I haven't spoken most of them. So, you know, I think if you you're at least show up there and, and speak to the employees and, or, and whoever's in charge of the departments, we're going to be that much ahead of the game. But when, when you don't have any representatives at all, it makes it tough. Right. You know, they don't show up until you absolutely request them so that was kind of that was one of the reasons behind trying to get everyone together that way the people were liaison living and us we can have a little just dis discussion about how we want to do formulate like the committees a little bit sounds good and then i also <clears throat> like to when we do this is get a, a list of what we've set for subcommittees because we have a few subcommittees going on right now we have the treasurer subcommittee um we have the treasurer subcommittee working on the public works one and then we have a personnel procedures There's one, and we have a subcommittee for negotiations with the dispatch right now. Mm -hmm. um, so I'd like to also have those and let's all sit down and kind of lay out, because then we can also talk about, we know what's coming up next. We know we have the negotiations with DPW as soon as they get out of the reorganization. Mm -hmm. We know we'll have negotiations with uh, police as soon as they get out of re have, uh, reorganization with their unions. So if we could go ahead and lay all those out maybe during this time as well, then we'd see the whole picture um, and I wouldn't be trying to think of what I've already promised to do and I'm trying to figure out whether it works in my schedule or not. So if we did it kind of all that at one time, and so we just need to choose a meeting when we might want to do that. Mm -hmm. Remote? It's fine. It's fine. Fine. Well, on a temporary basis, I mean, we, we all still have, have a department that we're responsible for at this point. Yes. Uh, the only one is Brian that nobody has for DPW. Should be addressed. We just said Jerry would though. Well, we just do that for now, and then if we can meet, if, if we Good. set, if we set a meeting before when the next month to flush this out. Yeah, I'm assuming you're meeting soon. Not yes. Yeah. I don't. I do want to wait until after town meeting. Oh yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, so if we could, we, we could do it on a Wednesday, or we could do it on a. Um, Sunday afternoon. Sunday, yeah, oh. Sunday. <laughs> Only kidding. Okay, do it on do it on a Saturday or do it on another day. We can do either one. We can do it what's during. This, well, if you're going to invite department. Yeah, what's we can do it during the day so the department heads could come. We could do it at four o'clock. Yeah. Like right after work, yeah. just for half an hour to get it done. Is that okay? Yeah, that's fine. Mm -hmm. I kind of sprung this on everybody, so I apologize. So you, you know, want, you have a habit of. Thinking too much to yourself. <laughs> so, uh, what? To actually, someone else got me thinking about this. So, um, so we, why don't we think about a day, and then later on tonight we have to talk about our schedules, and then we'll try to come up. We'll work out our schedules, and then we'll think more about what day we want to try to do. Is there a day that's best for the department heads for us to meet on? Well, we. Uh, we always have a department head meeting on the first Wednesday of every month, so that's kind of in everybody's calendar. 
But that would be before 10 a.m. Yes. We could do that. I think, I think other people are, are pretty flexible other days. So we want to say maybe maybe the second Wednesday. Well, they do it during the day, don't they? Right. And this next Wednesday, this next department head meeting in anticipation of the special <coughs> project going forward, we're going to be meeting over at the public safety complex to map out the the, the space. So uh, don't don't tie it to the yeah. department head meeting. Choose right. choose a date and we'll make it work. Okay. All right. So we've reorganized ourselves. Mm -hmm. Clerk. Excuse me. Oh, if clerk. If not done reorganizing, you haven't voted a uh, new clerk. Yes. He just reminded me. I always forget the clerk. I'm sorry. So we need a uh, new clerk. Is there any recommendations for a new clerk? Joyce? I would stay. I would mind staying. Second. <laughs> All those in favor? Aye. 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 Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you. <laughs> Could we um, maybe make a, like a ruling? I would like maybe have either 10 minutes or 15 minutes before the start of our meeting or at the end of our meeting to, for open to public. And that would be the only time that we would take comments. I'm or okay with that. Comments or um, things from the general public that might come in. I'm completely okay with Does that. Does anybody have a preference before or after our meeting? Would the beginning of our meeting work I better? I would say the beginning. Yeah. I, I completely agree. I just don't traditionally know how that's done. Not really. I mean, it's, if you're I, on the issues and it's an open forum meeting, then you got to address it well, at well, the time. No, you, you can do it. I mean, if you if you have a if you have a thirty well no we said ten minutes if you have a ten minute fifteen minute open uh, comment period at the beginning what it is is people can talk to you but you, we can't really address what they're saying. They're just telling us. Because we, have, well, we would have to vote on it without any information, but I think if people wanted to come to us about an issue, you know, same and thing as the planning board has, I think that's kind of beneficial to them to school have that the school too. committee has it too before. Well, love it. Well, well, Is it at the beginning of the meeting or at the end of the meeting? It's at the beginning of the meeting. Okay. And we have a policy around it, so we choose not to respond. Right. That's what sometimes people find a little. Well, actually, you can't, you can't discuss it if it's not on your agenda. Unless you want to invoke the 24 hour rule. But people could we can't discuss it, but they can comment. We don't, yes, restrict, they can comment. We don't restrict it to what's on the agenda. Correct. So why don't we finalize, let everybody have a chance to think about it, and when we have the retreat, that'll give people the opportunity to Talk investigate you're, multiple you're ways of doing it. About issues that aren't on the agenda. Correct. Correct. Okay. The, the issues on the agenda, you can't address until you get to the issue. Correct. 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 Okay. Yeah. This is just if somebody wanted to come in and. Yeah. Say their piece or something. Yeah. You know, yeah. and then you would have that little and they know time there's an opportunity. Frame. And if you, 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 if know you get neighbor. that out to the public, you know, then they know that that's when they have to come in and they don't have to wait until 10 o'clock at night to address right. something. Right. Can I ask particularly what are the, can I ask particularly what are the, the apprehensions to it? Uh, we, we have this policy and what um, the, the fact that our policy says we will listen, but we won't comment or respond, I think is difficult for people to understand. So I think it comes across sometimes that we are apathetic to the issue, and it is not that we are apathetic to the issue, it is what our policy says. But you always explain that, though, up front. Yes. Well, right. And I assume that you would probably be garnering information other than what's being presented to you before you ruled on anything that was brought to you, and that was what the genesis was for it. Okay. They, they can just say we'll take it under consideration and bring yeah. it up at the next, next meeting if okay. we have more we information. Right. right. That's okay. what you, That's you can't right. do that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Right. I completely agree with that.